Again, other mediums you put on paste and you cover things up. If you put something down you don't like, you just paint over it. Watercolor, you can't do that. So you have to plan ahead a little bit. So what I'm going to do is demonstrate just the proper way to use the, the kit, use your brushes, and how to put it on paper. Uh, some people miss this when they first start painting and they spend a few years painting their watercolors and their paintings are muddy and chalky and they're frustrated. And uh, so I usually get them started in painting a color chart or some small exercises generally designed to help them navigate their their paints properly. So the first thing again is having a watercolor kit that's set up. I have all my colors out ready to go. Um, I don't have to pull my tubes out and replenish so I'm ergonomically set up. I'm right-handed so I have my water here to my right, I have my paints right here. All I got to do is get color, boom, over to my paper. If you have your water over on this side or your paints everywhere, you're constantly doing this dance of the seven hydras and you end up dropping paint in the middle of a nice sky wash or something that you didn't intend. So the bottom line is you just want to make your, your working process as simple and as easy uh, and as efficient as you possibly can.